Hey everyone, my name's Cece, I'm a Carolina Social Influencer, and we thought it would be fun for me to show you how you can get painted up for a game. So I've got a lot of different things here. We've got some paint, which is safe to put on your face, we've been told. They didn't have Carolina blue, so we got white and blue, and we mixed it here, and we made it a perfect Carolina blue. And we've also got some white here and then all of these brushes and sponges and stuff like that. So we're just gonna kind of see how this goes. This is probably a really good time for me to tell you I've never done this before. I feel pretty confident. Like I think I've got the tools and the abilities to make this good. And if I don't, then you can see what I do wrong and then you can make sure you don't do that too. Kind of thinking we're gonna do blue and white and then maybe do like a Tar Heel situation. We're just gonna see as we get closer to it. And we're just gonna put white everywhere. Oh good, yeah. This is gonna go really well. I feel like Santa. <laughs> Pat, don't rub. That's something I learned in all the makeup tutorials that I've watched. Not that I've ever actually tried to do it. Should I go down my neck? Should I go down my neck? Um. We're gonna go down my neck, just just partially. Do we do my eyes? Probably, right? Okay, well that's enough for me. So I'm gonna let this dry for a second and then we're gonna do some more white because I kinda want it to be more white than this and then we're gonna go in with the blue. You know, some people go to bed, they like relax, they watch some Netflix. I just like to sit and, you know, watch James Charles do things I'll never be able to do. Layer two. Oh yeah, that's much better. Now we're glowing. Nope, that's not the way to do it. Don't use your fingers. Hmm. So the biggest challenge is the white. That's what we've learned, is trying to make the white look like white and not like whatever's going on here. And if it's not perfect, that's okay. Because from a distance or on ESPN, like you'll look amazing. And really, like that's all that matters. So far, I, I mean, I'm getting, it's getting better. I'm pretty happy with this. I'd say this is mostly even. Which side looks worse? This one is like not as good. So we're just gonna put blue on it. And also, we have glitter. I forgot to mention that. That'll literally fix anything. So now I'm gonna take, like I said before, we've got this mix here of blue and white that ended up being pretty much exactly Carolina blue on the first try, so that's pretty great. This is tempura paint, is that how you say it? It's actual paint, but it's non-toxic and it won't stain your skin. I'm going to take some of this and maybe one of these and um, do this half of my face because it does not look as good as this one. This is the part that I'm scared of. Ooh, it's kind of pretty though. All right, I'm not scared anymore. <laughs> Smells like paint. Wouldn't eat it, but I think it will be fine. Okay, so we've learned from our mistakes. Essentially, if you really screw up, put blue paint on it. Don't think we're gonna do my eye with this because that seems a little bit too risky. Like, we're already doing pretty well, which is not what I expected. I don't really wanna press my look and then like go blind. We're just gonna stop there. We're gonna quit while we're ahead. We're gonna let this dry for a second. So this is where we really get into some, some scary territory. And I have someone here who might help me if I really need the help. But first, we're gonna just see what we can do on our own. Where's my phone? Tar. Heel. This is what we're going for. We don't have any black. So we're just gonna do a foot and five toes and hope that that does the job. It's artistic, you know, art's never gonna be perfect. Nothing you ever do is ever gonna be perfect. In the end, all we can really do is try our best. Oh, I'm really scared. I feel like we've done so well, this is where it's all gonna go downhill. We'll put glitter on it if it's bad. We'll put glitter on it if it's bad. We'll put glitter on it if it's bad. Okay, well, it's too late now. We're already committed. This is supposed to be the heel. Is this even gonna work? Kinda bring it up. Kinda make a circle around the eye, perhaps. 
This brush is not working. Sponges are the way to go. And then we'll do a little bit above the eyebrow, and then maybe we'll do like the toes on the forehead. This is definitely interpretive. Mm, maybe. Well, you know, I now I'm realizing that definitely this is gonna be too close and our toes are gonna be in a very odd spot. What if we just like stamp it? Okay. Well, we're gonna use my fingers for this now because that's this is the big toe. It's a big boy. Let's see. One, two, two. Okay, pinky toe's looking a little large, but like I'm not that mad about it. And now we're just gonna let this dry and then we're gonna do all of the fun stuff. So I'm thinking glitter. I'm thinking like some additional artistic touches. Once you get the base down, this is where you can really just go nuts. This is actually not looking that bad. I'm kind of shook. Yes, ooh, yeah, you're right. Okay, so it's kind of sticking to my hand, so I think it's gonna kind of stick to the paint. Maybe if we like, I mean, come on. Okay, maybe. <gasps> oh yeah, that's what I wanna see. Hello, go heels. Okay, now we gotta do the toes. Oh, well, it's all over the floor too. I really admire those people who can like pull this kind of stuff off. Well, we have four toes now. Um, we're just gonna take a little, that's a little lopsided, it's fine. Really admire those people who can go and like do all of this for every game and be really committed. Cause like I'll stick a sticker on and call it a day. So now that I know I have this capability, honestly, you'll never see me another way again. I'm gonna look like this forever. This is my new daily routine. Welcome to Carolina. I can't wait to scare every prospective student because this is just who I am now. We've got a lot of glitter on this side, as you can see. I'm thinking now maybe we'll do this eyebrow because I kind of just want to put glitter on everything at this point. We're going to put a little bit more blue on the eyebrow because I know the glitter has to have something to stick to. So we're going to make my eyebrows blue. Wow, this really is paint. I feel it now. Take some of this glitter that I've dropped all over my table and then we're just going to stick it on. Oh yes, this is the part that really gets you. I feel like we could do more. Y'all have any ideas? We're gonna put a little bit more blue under here and kind of, we're trying to balance out. We've got a lot happening on this side. I feel like we need to kind of balance that. So we're gonna take some of this glitter and kind of do one of those, you know, one of these things. Maybe put some on here. Don't eat it. We can help it. Okay, I believe I'm done. <laughs> All right, so this is our final look. I think it turned out pretty well, actually. I really wasn't sure what we were getting into when we started this, but it's definitely a lot easier than you'd expect because I was kind of afraid of it, but it's definitely not that bad. Don't be afraid of this white. Make sure whatever white you use is definitely face and body paint because that way you can put a lot of it on. And I think putting a lot of white on definitely helps make it A, look white, and B, give you a good base to start with. Trust yourself because this, I mean, you get the idea. It's not perfect, but you get it. And always use glitter. Glitter can help fix any mistake. That's all we have for you today. Thank you so much for watching this video. Follow UNC Chapel Hill on Instagram and you can see some more of our content or you can follow me on Instagram at CC Huffman and let me know how you think that I did there. If you do this yourself, tag us in it because we would love to see what kind of art this has inspired. And as always, go Heels.